guys and welcome to my channel in today's video we got this Honda Accord this is an 05 model V6 but it doesn't matter 2003 4 5 if you have the same setup on these lights and uh, it does have brake light here and in here doesn't have a regular light that illuminates with your uh, headlight when you turn on your headlight here and here and uh, turn signal everything is in there so it's very easy to change the bulbs and you can do it yourself so I'm going to show you how to change these bulbs and that bulb you do need some tools, flathead, clip removers, number eight, deep socket, and I got this stick because what I'm gonna do is, uh, what I'm gonna do is uh, I'm gonna press the brake pedal just to show you which lights we're looking at. Even though the lights are working on this car, but I do want to demonstrate it because I do check all the lights and if anything is blown, I just change it out for the customer that spends a thousand, fifteen hundred dollars. But anyways, I'm gonna go inside. First, I'm going to turn on my uh, regular lights. No, no, first I'm going to press the brake because I don't want you to get confused. I want you to see which lights are working. Well, whatever's working here is supposed to be working over there and that one. So, one, two, three, everything should illuminate, okay? So, let me go inside and press the brake pedal. Okay, there we have it. Um, I'm sorry y'all, so the bulb is not out in here, but I am going to show you how to change the bulb here, so I am going to put on the light. So the brake light works here, there, and over there. So those are the three brake light bulbs that you should be checking, okay? And plus the bulb in here. So how to change the bulb in here, and plus the brake bulb, and that bulb, I'm going to show you right now. I made a little mistake because I was confused with another car, because uh, I thought this was supposed to come on. But let me turn off the brakes, and I'm going to put on regular headlights. There we have it, regular headlights. So when you put on your headlight, this bulb turns on, this bulb turns on, and that bulb turns on, and that bulb turns on. And when you press the brakes, these get brighter. So this is a dual flare bulb, so you do need to put a correct bulb. If you put a wrong bulb in, forget about it, you're gonna blow fuses, okay? Any wire, any connector that has three wire is pretty much a dual uh, flare bulb and a single flare bulb, okay? So let's get to this, I'm gonna open this trunk. Let me remove my, uh, let a guy right here, then we'll take the camera up close and personal inside. Okay, so I'm gonna go pop the trunk now and then we're gonna go inside. Okay, so now we're gonna lift this open. All right, a lot of stuff in here and uh, we're gonna avoid all that. We don't wanna look at any of this stuff. So first of all, I'm gonna put my tool here. I'm not gonna forget, don't worry. So to change out this bulb right here, what you're gonna do is, you're gonna pop this open right here, very simple, and to put it back in, you slide this side in, and you clip it back in, okay? But anyways, right in here, you have a whole bunch of bulbs, okay? You even have the reverse bulb. To change out the reverse bulb, it's a single flare. What you're gonna do is, you're gonna turn, you're gonna turn on that counterclockwise, and it's an orange looking bulb. And all you do is you pull out the bulb, just like that. And uh, there's a size here, I believe. Okay, the bulb does not have a uh, size, but it's a one little wire inside, so it's a single flare bulb. And you take a new bulb in, doesn't matter which way, this way or that way, you just stick in this bulb. And if you touched it with your hands, just take a cloth. I have something right here just to demonstrate. Clean it up. And you stick it back in, and you turn it kind of clockwise. I'm sorry, clockwise now. Now we got this uh, dual flare bulb right here. That's the brake bulb that illuminates. That's this one right here. So you take this and you twist it. And in here, you have another bulb. This is, notice, three wires, okay? Anything with three wires is dual flare bulb. And all you do is you pull out this bulb. This one uh, is, uh, the size here is 7443. So you take a new bulb, make sure you clean it up, but you can put it this way, that way, it doesn't matter and you stick this bulb in and again clean it off if you got grease on your hands and you take this bulb and you stick it right back in just like so and then you take your cover when you're done and you just clip it right back in it's the same procedure for this side same thing but however 
we got a little problem. What about these little bulbs here, okay? And uh, same thing goes for this one right here. So, a little bit that you need to do is you need to get a flat head and you turn this with a flat head. You can do it with your nails just like I did. Anyways, this clip comes out. So what you do is you remove this little guy right here and this comes out. You could use a, like a needle nose or, or even a flat head screwdriver. And this is the last one I'm gonna take off because I am gonna have more than enough room now to remove the little bolts back there, okay? In here, we have this reverse bulb, which is right here. What you're gonna do is you're gonna turn this counterclockwise and bring it out. The bulb size here is a 7440. It's a single flare bulb. So all you do, you pull it in, I pull it out and put it back in just like the rest of them we did. So I'm sure you guys got the idea already. And uh, line it up. Once you line it up, you turn it clockwise. And then we have this regular light that illuminates when you turn on your headlights. Even that bulb, if it's out, it's the same procedure on the opposite side. And all you do is you grab this guy right here Turn it counterclockwise, it's gonna be a small little bulb. And uh, the size is gonna be 194, I believe. Yeah, 194, same thing. It's a miniature bulb, it comes out. Doesn't matter which way you put it, you stick it back in. Make sure you get it straight, just like so. All right, after that, you're gonna line up everything where it's supposed to be at. Cause they got like three little guys. So this goes just like right there. And then it turns clockwise and you're done. All right, so to put everything back together, you're gonna have to force that in. All right, so the clips that we took off. Even this clip, you don't have to take it off because uh, you can just yank it from right here. There's your axis from right there. And then don't forget your second clip, which was right here. And this one, you don't have to turn it back in. Trick, push it right back in. All right, guys, so what about this third bulb? Okay, how do you take that out? Okay, this one is very simple. It's right here, right down here. You turn it kind of clock, this is loose. You turn it kind of clockwise, it comes out. Single flare bulb, and the size is a 7440. There you go. All right, and then uh, you put in a new bulb, and you turn it, click it back in, and that's it. All right, guys, thank you for watching, guys. I hope this video helps you guys and uh, save some money. So how much these bulbs will cost you? Probably all the bulbs are gonna cost you under 20 bucks, okay? You get two bulbs in a pack for five bucks or three bucks and um, just buy the correct bulbs, do it yourself. I already gave you a size except the one that I that had no number on it. But anyways, uh, just pick up a set of bulbs. You should always keep spare bulbs. All right, thank you for watching again and don't forget to subscribe, share and like.